True Peace Kins, DHL Supply Chain expands agreement with Locust Robotics to implement 2,000 robots globally, man. Peep the slang. DHL Supply Chain today announced that it plans to acquire up to 2,000 mobile robots from Locust Robotics Corp. as part of its wider accelerated digitalization strategy. The global logistic company has expanded its four-year-old relationship with Locust in its largest deployment to date. It is particularly important for us to be able to consistently optimize our supply chains. Assisted picking robots are very effective in this respect, stated Marcus Voss, Global Chief Operating Officer and CIO of DHL Supply Chain. So far, more than 500 assisted picking robots are already in industrial use in our warehouses in the USA, Europe, and the UK. By the end of 2021, another 500 robots are to be added in a total of more than 20 locations, man. Peep the slang. Locust Robotic meets accelerated demands. Locust Robotic said its multi-robot system includes autonomous mobile robots, AMRs, that work with human pickers to improve accuracy and productivity by two to three times with less labor than traditional picking systems. The Wilmington Mass based company said its Locust bots can learn the most efficient routes within warehouses and be easily integrated without disrupting flows. During the past year, the jab pandemic has accelerated e-commerce demand, mark making labor intensive order fulfillment even more critical, said Locust. The company claimed that its award winning system can help retailers, third party logistic providers, three PLs and specialty warehouse meet and exceed increasingly complex and demanding fulfillment requirements. In November 2020, Loki said it had enabled the picking of more than 250 million units. In February 2021, the Wilmington Mass based company announced 150 million in Series E funding. Man, Peter Slang, DHL Supply Chain, DHL. Continues growing Locust bot fleet. DHL Supply Chain first used Locust Robotics AMRs in a trial in 2017. DHL Supply Chain is part of Bond, Germany based Deutsche Post DHL Group, which has more than 400,000 employees worldwide and had revenue of more than 66 billion euros. 80. 0.5 billion U.S. in 2020. In March 2020, just as the pandemic began affecting the U.S., DHL expanded its relationship with Locust, planning to obtain a thousand robots at 12 sites by the end of last year. The collaborative picking technology has clearly proven its effectiveness and reliability in modern Warehousing said Voss, more locations have already been identified with concrete implementation roadmaps for the remaining robots, which will be deployed in 2022. However, the overall potential for assisted picking robots in our DHL warehouses is much bigger. So we are confident that we will meet the targets we have set ourselves together with Locust Robotics. DHL said that Locust Bots can help reduce time spent on maneuvering push carts through warehouses, lower physical strain on employees, and increase picking efficiency. They assisted picking robots can display images of goods to be picked, calculate optimal navigation routes, and reduce required training time. It said, man, peep the slang. DHL supply chain in America. Contract logistic using the locust in power. Our site is shipping medical implants for next day surgeries. So we consider ourselves to have a zero defect environment. That means that we have to hit a home run every day and make sure we have no misses and we have all time shipments. Okay. Our customers are demanding shorter lead times, and that's how innovation comes to play. 
Lapa's robotics, I have been a great decision for us uh, because we have seen really good results. And it improved our cycle time to get the product out the door on time by our service level cut off. We have seen a reduction in cycle times by 50%, which is key for e-commerce and retailers. We have seen a productivity improvement by up to 200%, which again allows us to keep the same headcount but process double the volume. way to get product out of here with the robots they just come to you and you just put your product in and you let it go and you just continue as the robot comes in. Productivity rates that we have is about 78 units an hour. Mm. So we're currently thinking about 150 units an hour. Mm. And we're also seeing a reduction in training time by 80%, which is also really good for e-commerce and retailers. to manage the business much closer and in detail. It provides us real-time data to show me what my current requirements are and what my productivity is. Since it is real-time, it brings a lot of visibility to the operation. to the operation and the, and the general manager, you know, he was just surprised at how smooth the implementation was. Also, just how flexible and scalable it is as well. It's easy to just add additional robots and get them up and running really quickly. The WMS uh, integration was clean. It's been very impressive because they were very flexible. We just pass paperwork over to the Locust system, and then the Locust system passes the paperwork back to our WMS whenever it's completed. The innovation is very simple. It fit our model. It's helped us gain some very good numbers as far as productivity. It was easy to implement. It's easy to maintain. It's easy to train on. Our customer is seeing some better results of us completing our SLAs at the end of the night. This innovation has helped us be the change. I'm going to slang, Robots of Digitalization Initiative, in addition to AMR Hardware, DHL Supply Chain, said it relies on software and cockpit solutions that provide real-time information on the status of customers, global service logistics network, assessing the pool of big data and implementing algorithms and artificial intelligence has proven to be a game changer in global supply chain planning and will be rolled out further, it said. DHL Supply Chain added that its robotics hub enable warehouse system to be integrated with the Locus bots, which have been well received by staffers. During peak operational periods, the robots provide an optimal solution for capacity expansion as we can swiftly bring in more robots with minimal onboarding effort to the existing fleet, said the company. Our expanded partnership with DHL reflects the increasing demand for warehouse digitalization worldwide to meet today's exploding fulfillment challenges, said Rick Falk, CEO of Locus Robotics. Locus is proud to be a value technology resource that is helping DHL realize their strategic vision of digital transformation. Man, peep the slang. Customer was looking for a solution for an East Coast distribution center. DHL was a perfect fit because of DHL's green initiatives. The facility is 358,000 square feet. Workforce right now is about 80 people, kind of a mixture between full time, seasonal, and some temporary workers. And we've just added some new additions to the family with the local spots. When we first got the robots, everyone was very excited. Some of the associates were nervous, but once they saw what they could do at the site, they were very excited. I thought they were interesting and then like a little like kind of scary at first, but they're very simple to learn and a great piece of equipment to use. I think overall they were great. At first, I was a little annoyed about technology, but now it's easier to do with the robots instead of pulling a car. 
before with car picking, we were around about a 70 or 80 units per hour. And then now with Locus, we are at about typically 150 up to about 180 an hour. It's really turned around their delivery times. Um, typically, it used to take orders four or five days. Now it's taken one or two days. So it's it definitely helped our productivity significantly. Uh, the Locus box are great on the accuracy. It displays on the screen, it go picks the product, scans it, drops it in the slot it's supposed to drop in. Mm. Very seldom that uh, anything ever leaves here with an accuracy issue. They make it easy because they tell you which specific items to get. And if you have the wrong item, it literally tells you on the screen that you have the wrong item. I mm. didn't have to worry if I was going to make a mistake. There's a ton of reports of Locust cases that we rely on on a daily basis. And everything from charging time for bots, number of picks per bot, productivity reports for our picking stats, and if we see outliers, we're able to correct those right away. The Locust works well with our Manhattan system. It prioritizes our orders. It looks at the orders that stream into us. It takes the same day orders and it puts that at the top of the work queue. It doesn't matter if we're doing e-com or retail or wholesale. Locust serves us very well in the omni-channel environment. The only thing that changes is the type of container that we put on the bot. The ability of this solution to scale up and down, depending on the needs of the business and the volumes, has been really paramount for us. We have four times in the year where we're usually asking Locust to, to get more bots for a short period of time. We can have up to 47 bots on the floor during peaks, and it, it just really helps with the productivity. And we just tell Locust what we need, and they'll ship them to us for a month, and we ship them back afterwards once we're done with the peaks. We start off with the uh, vision of what Locust can do for us on the pick process. That's expanded to other areas. What can the Locust solution help us with on refunds? What can the Locust solution help us with on putaways? It's endless. Uh, working with Locust has been amazing. It's just been really interesting to kind of watch it from the day we implemented to where we are now. Just from a sheer innovation point of view, it's a good business fit for this customer. At the end of the day, it's about helping our associates do their job more efficiently and effectively, and the partnership with Locust has helped us do that. Hmm. Man, Pete the Slang, Locust Robotics, DHL, man.